Welcome back, and this is Carly's Garage. It is January 17th it's of 2021. I got my new carburetor. Not new, I still have to rebuild it. Um, but you're going to be here for the opening of it. I got my jacket right here. Packed nicely. <laughs> Very dirty and rusty. Hold on, hold on. Let's pull this out of here. Get all that foam off there. Definitely dirty. It's so light, so small. I just got a manual choke. This is an Auto Light eleven hundred manual choke carburetor. Most of the most of the times they end up on a, a six in line engine, typically. Um, yeah. Most new ones I find come with electric electric um, chokes, and mine comes with a manual choke, so I spend a long time trying to find this carburetor, and luckily I found one with a manual choke that I do not have to convert, because that would be a pain in the ass. <laughs> Anyhow, I guess I have my spacer. I'm going to grab it, and we're going to check and see if this fits. to find it. That's right here. Well, still got pieces to it. <laughs> Anyhow, this is the way it go, if I remember correctly. This is the spacer that I have that came with the What's in there? You hear that? If anyone could tell me what that is, that'd be very helpful. I'm still new to this, so this doesn't sound quite normal to me, in my eyes at least. Oh, oh, looks like it might fit her. <gasps> yes, it fits. Perfect. This bad boy's gonna go right onto this engine. It's going to end up right here. But as you can tell, that it's going to be more of an angle. But it's gonna supposed to sit like this. So yeah, it's supposed to sit like that. And that will be where the carburetor sits. Yes. But can someone please tell me what that is, what it could possibly be? Thank you. Um well that. You were there for the unboxing of the Autolite 1100 carburetor. Small barrel, typically used for six inlines. Um, yeah. Well, thank you for that. I hope to create another video and see what else we can do. The next one should be um, the rebuild of this carburetor. <laughs> 